Well, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and children of all ages. There's a new lock in town, and the lock is called a fortress. Uh, it's a 40 millimeter black plasticized, completely plasticized. You couldn't shim it to save your life because you couldn't get anything down in there. Now you'd have to cut off all that plastic to shim it, but you probably could. Uh, it's probably a Chinese lock. I would be real surprised if it's not. Um, here's the keyway, also plastic covered. It looks like a master lock knockoff to me. We shall see. Today we're going to single pin pick it, and then we are going to rake it. So, stating that, we're going to uh, open it with first the single pin picking. And to do that, we're going to use a Peterson pry bar. Peterson pry bar. Love Peterson pry bars. And we're going to use a homemade, homebrew pick made out of windshield wiper inserts. Made just by me. So, top of the keyway. And we go in. Trouble, it's giving me trouble. Can you believe it? Let's go to the bottom of the keyway. Why is this thing messing with me now? There it is. Open. Now to do the raking, what we're going to do to rake this baby is we're going to use Bogota, custom-made Bogota by Compiche, and a Peterson tension wrench. One of those little bitty Peterson tension wrenches. And the Bogota. Got it. This Bogota makes short work of many of these Chinese locks. Uh, so guys, I haven't made a video in a while because I've been working on an Abus Euro cylinder and I haven't been able to get it open, but I thought I'd just throw this one out there to show you about this new one. Keep it safe, have fun, and keep it legal.